The ongoing 90 Day Fiancé Season 9 has kept fans intrigued with its new cast members who love to share behind-the-scenes stories about themselves after the cameras stop rolling. This week on 90 Day Fiancé, Episode 6 was entertaining due to many uncomfortable moments. Situations arising out of miscommunication and misunderstandings caused arguments between a bunch of couples. Even though spoilers suggest most of them will navigate the 90 days smoothly and get married in the end. Ariella Weinberg and Binium Shibber's Money Matters have taken center stage. Seeing New York for the first time made Binium want to move there as he rethinks restarting his career as an MMA fighter. Guillermo Roger got grilled again on this 90DF episode, this time around by Cara Bass's best friend. Guillermo admitted he hates Cara's drinking habit, and Gibri Bell's mama Holla Bell criticized Miona Bell's dressing sense. The couple going through the worst time in their relationship, however, is Bilal Haziz and Sheeda Sween. Sheeda got touchy-feely with Bilal as a joke while he was driving to the mosque to meet his ex-wife and extended family, which he felt was aggressive. An upset Bilal didn't introduce Sheeda to his community during Jummah, and she confessed he was blowing things out of proportion. Muhammad Abdelhand expected Eve or Alano to act like a Muslim woman and not be alone in the same room as a plumber who was there to attach the bidet. Lastly, Ty's Raman's first meeting with Patrick Mendes's brother John didn't go well when she reprimanded him for having beer in the morning. Emily shares breastfeeding confessions. Emily, although new to the 90 Day Fiancé franchise, has been clapping back at critics after she was bashed for her breastfeeding preferences. Recently, Emily did a Q&A session during which she opened out about her breastfeeding journey. Emily was asked on Instagram if she still feeds Coben, who's now nearly three years old. Emily replied, not anymore. She stopped feeding Coben when he was ready. Emily also spoke about why breastfeeding has been a rough journey for her as a new mom. Coben had a tongue and a lip tie explained Emily. Because of this, nursing him was so painful that every time he latched, she was crying. We got it released and that made all the difference, Emily told the 90 Day Fiancé viewer. Binium clears up rumors about first son. Before Ariella, Binium was married to an American woman called Bria with whom he had a son. According to 90 Day Fiancé, Bria left Binium after thinking that he'd cheated on her and took little Simon along. In an Instagram update, Binium shared that some rumors concerning his first son Simon were being spread online. 90 Day Fiancé star Binium wrote that these rumors could potentially be harmful to his son if he were to read them in the future. Binium explained that he loves his son too much to ever give up his rights or to let someone else adopt him. He has never been legally adopted by anyone, wrote Binium in his emotional appeal. He also added that in America, if someone's parental rights were to be terminated, they would still have to pay child support. But that would never ever factor into my decision making, said Binium as he admitted that he always wants to be there to support his baby. After Jibri, Miona starts selling clothes from the show. Many jaws dropped after Jibri revealed that his ripped pants from 90 Day Fiancé Season 9 sold at an auction for $28,000. However, the validity of Jibri's sale was doubted by fans who thought he was faking it. Meanwhile, Miona shared a new Instagram post advertising her Poshmark account, 
where she and Jibri would be selling some amazing pieces that they've worn on the show. Mion also realized what it is that makes Jibri and her dressing sense so unique. Miona's mom is a designer, and she sews most of the makeup expert's clothes. On the other hand, Jibri used to work as a celebrity fashion stylist and personal shopper in Los Angeles for years. It was their love for fashion and the way they expressed themselves through their wardrobe that really brought 90-day fiancé couple Jibri and Miona together.